You, you say NMSL to me when you're angry. These are pinion initials for your mother is dead, which is a serious insult commonly used by Little Pink's Nimasila, Nimasila, Nima, Nima, Nimasila, Nimasila. What? <laughs> We actually in the U.S. in 2015 when it became legal for, uh, we met actually in 2001 when we were in graduate school in America. <laughs> shown a pinkish heart with purity talking about the loyalty of the little pinks to the Chinese government propaganda <laughs> Desiring for dogs, cats, bats, and civets. Uh, this refers to uh, the proclivity of some Chinese people for eating uh, wild game, which is dangerous, um, especially if it's not handled and, and cooked properly. And uh, it has been implicated in the uh, 2003 spread of SARS and also in the 2019 spread of COVID-19. <laughs> It's illegal to breach the firewall. You'll be missed if who discovers it. So this is talking about the fact that Xi Jinping's famous saying, we miss them, quote unquote. So this is talking about, it's ironic that people who violate the Communist Party's rhetoric will be missed. So this is a statement from Xi Jinping, which is ironic because the Communist Party is not really going to miss these people at all. And of course, many of these people have disappeared, uh, the people who have angered the Communist Party. <laughs> Okay, you've been really strong with a single shoulder throughout 10 miles. Now, this is one that I didn't get the first time I watched the video, but uh, our commentators were really helpful. They are saying that it talks about Xi Jinping describing an amazing, supposedly amazing feat that he accomplished. He supposedly carried 200 caddies of wheat 10 miles across mountain roads without changing shoulders. Uh, so he carried the wheat on one shoulder supposedly for 10 miles, a, a very heavy uh, amount of wheat. I don't really believe it because, uh, you know, dictators have tendency to inflate the their uh, persona, you know, make themselves out to be heroes. Kim Jong-il claimed that he hit 11 holes in one, in one round of golf. And Kim Jong-un claimed that he could drive a car at the age of three. So uh, this is par for the course or common for, uh, you know, authoritarian leaders to, to make up false statements about their supernatural abilities or supposed supernatural abilities uh, in order to make them look stronger to their citizens. Okay, um, thank you everyone watching and commenting on YouTube. Thank you very much. <laughs> Carrying cotton and collecting his favorite honey, common prosperity. So this is uh, making a play on Xi Jinping's nickname, which is Winnie the Pooh. That's one of his nicknames. And Winnie the Pooh has a love of honey. Um, cotton refers to the use of slave labor in Xinjiang to collect cotton. China, also common prosperity refers to China confiscating the property of the richer people, um, supposedly in order to to make everyone more equal. When in actuality, well, we'll find out later in the song. <laughs> Worked hard to combat poverty in the Re Leak Farm. Okay, so again, this is talking about Xi Jinping's idea of common prosperity, which is a misnomer, by the way, a wrong name. Um, so it's 
talking about the the re leak farms refer to leaks. Leaks. The top of the leak plant is harvested, but the the root keeps growing new uh, top parts. So they're comparing to the slaves who are alive, but in reality they have no life because uh, they are forced to work for little to no reimbursement. So the leaks are an allegory for the slave that is used in China. One thousand is certainly beyond expectation. And this is something else I learned from the comments on our previous video. And uh, this refers to the Chinese premier, Li. I'm probably mispronouncing that, but he states that 600 million people, or about 43% of the claimed population of China, still earn less than 1,000 RMB per month, which is a pittance. It's uh, about 156 US dollars per month. So, uh, so this is Xi Jinping's common prosperity in reality. And that is people, a uh, very significant proportion of the population is still making below poverty wages in China. Pardon me for offending, hurt you of your feelings or hurt your feelings. Oh, I hear a sound. Fragile self-esteem has broken into pieces. Again, referring to the fragile egos of the little pinks or the the online army of Chinese netizens who propagate and defend Chinese communist propaganda on the internet. Don't be angry, little pinky. Uh, censor all sensitive terms. Uh, again, it's going back to the Great Firewall in China and uh, and them trying to control online speech. Otherwise, send for re-education and farming hammy melons. Uh, it refers to, again, to the Xinjiang's forced re-education camps or concentration camps and uh, the slave labor connected to those. Okay, I learned this through the comments also. Swallow the apple most likely refers to uh, the closing of Apple Daily, um, the newspaper in Hong Kong, which happened recently, um, maybe a month or two ago couple of months ago, I think. And I did see this in the news, but I didn't c connect the two. Uh, I didn't connect the closing of Apple Daily to the song. So basically the Chinese government through their puppet government in Hong Kong had Apple Daily shut down uh, in Hong Kong. And it was kind of a freewheeling um, newspaper that, was, that printed uh, things that angered the Communist Party in China.